So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are up to fine and sound in this video we'll cover this amazing lab so first of all click on start lab and if you are new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel now let's get started so first of all you have to open the cloud console incognito window now here it is getting signed in automatically if it asks for username and password check the lab instruction for it here you have to just click on I understand and then here you will get some kind of pop up so here also you have to just scroll down and click on I agree and then click on agree and continue now we will activate the cloud shell where we will be initiating all the tasks so just click on it and here you may get option to continue and authorize yourself so just stay tuned and click on continue and authorize yourself just click on continue and authorize yourself now if you're new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel and for skill badges always check the description box and lab free courses are also updated now here basically it is getting authenticated so just wait for a few more seconds now let me increase the font size now come to the lab instruction first step is that we will configure the environment first of all we will just set the project id and after that if it is saying to export the zone or region we will do like this only so just export the region and carefully okay now we have to export the zone first we exported the region now it's time to export the zone after that what we have to do we have to create a cloud storage bucket do you know that the cloud storage buckets are really unique you cannot have same names for them so always check the project id for creating the bucket and if you are making personal bucket make sure it's unique so here just run the versioning command we are setting the versioning on it so it is also done now let's proceed to the next step so if you haven't liked the video yet do like the video and subscribe the channel now we, we are creating a directory so just create it like this and after that we'll create a file name firewall.tf so copy the name i hope you are aware with the nano editor don't worry i am showing how you can create the file similarly we have to create variable.tf file also so just type nano space file name and hit enter now copy the entire contents from here and paste over here now to save control x y and then hit enter now we have to create again the another file don't worry you will be able to complete it type nano space file name and then hit enter paste the contents over here then use control x y and then hit enter so finally both the files have been saved now we have to create a output file for output file name just type nano space file name and hit enter now paste the content again control x y and then hit enter now once you have done this you can run the terraform init command and we have three commands terraform init then plan then apply so can you describe what the functions they do in the comment section let's see who can describe it better in simple language so here if you type apply you have to just type yes to initiate the settings basically initiate the program so it is just creating the firewall ssh the what is the name of the firewall allow ssh so it is creating it so finally it has been created now we'll move forward to the lab instructions and check the score so if you like the way i have solved this lab do like the video and subscribe to the channel and for other remaining lab and lab free courses you can check the description box playlist all things are available thank you have a great day